if you want to trick the guys in the music store with expertise, do this the sample and hold thing. Uh, that's a little bit more complicated. I hope I get it uh, immediately over here. So what I need is a noise. I need a random voltage, uh, the AA118 uh, from Depra is okay for that. And then you need a, a sample and hold module. I got this A184 minus one. It's also doing sample and hold, but it's also doing uh, some other thing, things like slew limiter. It's nice little thing in one place uh, for many things. So uh, first of all, I take the output of this thing, uh, this sample and hold thing, the A184, into the CV1 of this VCO here. And then I take the VCO output, as usual, into the in of this gain. But nothing happens. So this sample and hold thing needs some sort of trigger. Where do, we, do I get it from? The first trigger will be uh, this random output of the noise. It's producing all sorts of frequencies randomly, and I put it into the sample hold TH in. And then I need, secondly, from our LFO, you already know, the A147, I'll take a square wave into the trigger in of this thing, and immediately you got this sound. And then when I use the LFO speed here, I can speed it up. You probably heard this, be this before. Yeah, that's nice. Sounds like Pink Floyd or something. Or this. Pulse width again. You remember that one? Or the tuning? Here it gets really crazy and this is really fun. Now the fun starts with the Eurorack. Frequency up to something like that and play around with the tunes and whatever you want to do, uh, change the level of the noise uh, and the rate. And then we go crazy on this thing. Bye bye, okay, next video.